Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. My husband has a very bad temper and finds it hard to control his anger. His impatience comes from his upbringing and not knowing who his father is. He served in the Marines, which has also shaped his views. What do you advise for both of us? Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Be patient. You are saying his impatience is coming from this, 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 and this. It may well be true, but that is how you are looking at it. If you come to a doctor, the doctor will say, maybe it's right, this, this, and this, but there are others, there are other things that are there that you are not seeing also. In that kind of situation, what is it that you can help? What is it that you cannot help? Can you help it? That it can you change its upbringing? No. Correct. Can you change what his experiences with his father is? You cannot. Can you change his experience being in the Marines? You cannot. You cannot change. It is there. Can you change your relationship, your uh, communication with him? Can you do that? To make it easier, maybe for him? Because now the question is saying the problem is with him, not with you. So if he has a problem... Are there certain things that you can do to make it a little bit easier for him? Yes. Find then those things, what you are doing, that makes it easy for him to be impatient. And if you love your husband and your family, and the sanctity of marriage enough, then you're going to say, I'm going to sacrifice certain things. I know these things make him to be impatient. I'm going to try to stop. That much you can do. You cannot change anything else. That time, if you are patient with that, then Allah is sabr. Allah is the creator of patience then Allah will send patience to you and to your husband. If you say that he is impatient with the both of you, find out then what your relationship with him is. Be patient. How are you going to be patient? You're going to be careful. Because impatient people, they are not careful. They just do. They just say, isn't it? They don't weigh, they don't think, they don't consider. They're just doing it. Those are impatient people. What does patience mean? You are careful. You are careful for what? You are careful that it might get broken. You are careful that you might be wrong. You are careful that Allah may be upset with you. You are careful. And if you are careful with the ways of haq, then haq will take care of you. But if you say, I'm not careful, he cannot change, I cannot change, then we say, good luck to you. What can we do? So be patient. Be careful. Inshallah, that time, if you are careful, your husband will also have more patience, and he will be careful. And he will start stepping on his ego. That time, inshallah, when he finds a sheikh, and he decides to follow a sheikh, then slowly these things will change. But if it's not, it may be slightly more difficult. A man is sick, but if he refuses to admit that he is sick and he doesn't want to see a doctor, what's going to happen now? Is he going to get better? No, he's going to get worse. But can the doctor do anything? No. We pray 
it'll be easy for you, inshallah. Assalamu alaikum.